Yo guys, what is up? It is Legend Reginald here today, back at it again with a new vid. And today we are back in the realms of the TikTok. Ooh! I love TikTok, baby. Yes, I do. Mm. So, what is the subject I talk about a lot on my channel? Oh, that's right. It is I, Carly. Yeah. Ah. Don't do that at home, kids. Okay. So, uh, here we go. I thought it'd be funny to react to the most popular and best iCarly TikToks because, as you know, if something is popular, that automatically means it's good. So, I'm ready. I love iCarly, and I want to know what the heck fans of iCarly can do with such a show. Hopefully, these are really funny, and without any further ado... Ooh, here's a spicy hot one to start things off. This one is called... Never forget the time at Jordan Fisher. Okay, the pop singer. Yeah, I've heard of him. Uh, tried to date Carly, and he was so romantic. Ooh. Hi, I'm Clark. Nice to meet you, Clark. So you'd like to take Carly to the dance? I might rather, rather just, just make out with her. Next! <laughs> <laughs> okay, so this is just a scene from the show, but already it started things off. Yo, I did not know that was Jordan Fisher, and then once again, proving my point that you learn something new every day. Now, wait, my point was that every three days, but... Uh, no, I just spit. And nonetheless, though, it is important that we do learn from our days. We take in the knowledge in our craniums, what we learn every single day. Knowledge is power. And I'll tell you what, though. Yo, <laughs> I didn't know that was you, bro. But you know what? But you know what? You're getting an automatic follow from me, though. You're getting a follow, dog. 3.6 million followers on TikTok. Whoa, this guy's going places. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, wait, what's this? I, Carly, laugh, laugh, laugh. You are grounded. Oh no. Or oh no. Till college. Till college? I think that's actually extra funny how she's literally just screaming to herself and, you know, no one's there to play Spencer. Like, I know someone's probably gonna duet that, you know, obviously watering down the fun. But what I was thinking though was like, holy crap! Like, all you out there who do make TikToks, like, Obviously, I, you know, seclude myself in a room, so that way I don't have anybody watching me, but have you all ever had your parents interrupt you while making a TikTok that... Ooh. Obviously, likely, they're so out of it, because, I mean, most of them probably don't even know what the app is. So, I mean... <laughs> obviously, I can't relate, but I can, like, empathize the cringe. Ooh. Ooh. Good stuff, though. Not bad. Next one. The Wonders of Vinyl Rap? I'm not sure what this has to do with iCarly, but hey, I like vinyl rap and blue and periwinkle and purple and such, so let's let's give this a click, yeah. What? Ooh, we going Drake and Josh with a power drill, though. Okay, so that was very iCarly right there, guys. Right down to the fact that, you know, we have a power drill, much like an I Date a Bad Boy. She gives Griffin a power drill, very iCarly-esque. We have a man in a hat, very iCarly. And we have the Magic Fist. This. this is some quality iCarly TikTokage right here. This is the best one I've seen yet. Who all remembers these? Petroleum Jelly. Oh my god. <laughs> and then he's like... Yo, but shout out to whoever made that All Night Party song. Because low-key, around the time that was like... They started playing that a lot in the episodes around like 2010 or something. And I'm like, that definitely suits the like club party like lifestyle that the charts were facing back in that day so i'm like yeah nowadays that song sounds kind of dated but like the thing is back in the day that was actually really appropriate for you know the lifestyle that was going on man but yeah in regards to the tiktok we portrayed the character of spencer very believably almost too believably to the point where it's not funny yeah but no <laughs> but i mean yeah it was kind of funny i mean he used petroleum jelly and like i think a weaker tiktok though would have been just like him doing one of the pranks that he did in the episode. So I'm glad that he did vary it up. And, you know what I'm saying? Use the jelly gel, you know? Yeah, petroleum jelly. Yeah. All right. Okay, here's one. We didn't deserve this show. Here's one right here. Mouth sync, which seems a little off, but okay. Four. 
portrayed that with more emotion than Spencer did, I think. That's the funny thing, yo. <sighs> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh man. Oh. Let's see. Sam and Chuck spin off. Oh my god. Sam didn't like Freddy. Chuck didn't like Spencer. No wonder these two got along. So I'm walking down the street with the Ryan Ochoa, and I'm walking down the street with Mitch McCurdy. <laughs> Damn! <laughs> And I think that that might be like the the real Chuck on iCarly. What? Ryan Ocho. Uh. Okay. Yo, but that. Yo, they were vibing though. That's. <laughs> it's just like. Mm. I don't have too much to say about that one though, honestly, low key. But, low key. But you know. Sam and Chuck should have happened though. All right, let's do this one. My brother is Freddie Benson from iCarly. Mm, let's see if this is true, because a lot of times people say people look alike, but then I'm just like, I'm not convinced. So, hopefully I am. Yeah. Hey, yo, famous relative check. Him? Hey, Freddie. All right, I'm just gonna say right now, what in the name of Slimy Sister Samuel Solomon's slippery seat? <laughs> what in the name of Slimy Sister Samuel Solomon's sausages was that? Oh my God, that, oh, oh. that was not Freddie Benson, guys. That was. That was Brady Finson, man. Bre Brady Finson Benson, man. I. Uh, that faker, yeah, imposter. That was not. Mm, not even close to Freddy. No, not even close, yo. And then finally, to round off these iCarly TikToks, here's one I made. Yeah. <laughs> Follow me on TikTok, baby. Woo! Alright. So, here it is. And I lost it. Hold on one second. Here we go. <laughs> so yeah, that was basically me in my room and it was like, you know, when your boyfriend's naked, you and your boyfriend are naked, your parent walks in. I mean, obviously, I've never had that kind of experience and I, I'm very thankful I've never had that kind of experience, but I do think it is very relatable for a lot of people. And I'm just like, yo, if you're gonna be naked in your bedroom, do it in a room with a locked door. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, okay? Lock the door, son. All right, man. Yeah, y'all, y'all stupid, uh, stupid kids out there, man. But all right. But no, no cap, no cap, though. Here, here's the deal. But anyways, though, I hope you guys enjoyed my iCarly TikTok reactions. There's a lot of interesting ones today, a lot of funny, <laughs> funny ones. And uh, yeah, let me know if there's a topic you want me to do more TikTok reactions on, because like this. Obviously, it was pretty dope, so... And if you enjoyed the video, please consider giving it a like, because you know what I'm saying? By giving it a like, you're not just helping me. You're helping me. So, <laughs> if you guys enjoyed the content, though, please, you know, like and subscribe. would be more than grateful. And comment down below what you think, because obviously comments help the video in the search results. But Because here at Legend BTV, your comments are more than welcome. Bye, guys!